In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the cam sensors on this BMW 550i. These are going to be located in the valve covers at the top of the engine. Let's get into it. I'm going to remove this top cover, use a 10 millimeter socket, take these nuts off. Grab the cover, slide it right up, take this cover off. I'm just going to grab the cover. You're, you're going to pull that way. There's just grommets holding it on. I'll just take this weather strip, pick that up, push that out of the way. There's a bar right here. I'm just going to take a pry bar, just pop that off there. That's going to be loose there. Using a 13 millimeter socket, there's a wing nut right here. Just twist it to the left about 90 degrees. Then this lifts up and we'll disconnect the connectors, push down on the tab. Same for this one. Set that aside. This trim piece here, take this off, just fold it around the hood, hood strut, slide that out. This center retainer right here has a little latch right here. So just lift up on that and then this whole piece slides towards the driver's side. Using a T25, take this screw out. Using a 13 millimeter socket, we're going to take these wing nuts, twist those to the left. Just about a quarter turn. That's good. Now this will be loose. Separate that. And it pulls out. And we can see the sensor underneath where this conduit is. We'll just lift this up, get some of these wires out of the way. You can grab the connector. I'm just going to use a pick. Just get underneath the connector. Just try to disconnect it. There we go. There's the connector. Using an E6 socket, take the bolt out. I'll pull that out. I'll just grab the sensor. You can wiggle it back and forth a little bit. And pull that out. And you want to take a new O-ring, put it on the sensor, and put a little silicone grease on the O-ring. We'll line that up, push that in place. That's good. Take the screw, get the screw started. And we'll torque that to 45 inch pounds. And take the connector. Line that up. And plug it in. Click it in place. And that was the intake. On the passenger side, if you're doing the exhaust, that's further down. And you're going to do the same for the other side as well. Now we can push this conduit back in place. 
and take this panel, slip that in place, get this under the other panel. Good. Twist that. And the other wing nuts. It's secured. Put that screw in, secure that down. Install this lock. Just line that up. Lock it in place. Put this side panel in. Get that in position. right there and the cover it has your cabin filter slide the, the feet in the back and then we'll connect the connectors and just twist the wing nut it's good yeah this retaining bar Clip that on. The weather strip goes up top. Secure that in place. Put this cover on. Slides into place. Get it lined up. Push the grommets in. There we go. Put the cover on top. Put the nuts in. Get those started. And snug those down. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.